Hey, what's up YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, and it's time for another review. It's review time, people. It's your favorite Pennsylvania reviewer, Eddie Hill. And today, we will be reviewing Loyal Subjects, Udaraka. And you're probably wondering, why did I have to retake this video quite a few times? Well, there's a reason. I forgot to explain about these display bases, and I forgot to leave out details in this review. So, this is the final retake this Saturday. And these are the exact same display bases, so I'm not going to bother taking out this one, because it's the same as the... Loyal Subjects, Udaraka. So, I'm probably only going to... Sorry if I have to correct myself. I'm only going to use one display base on my shelf. I'm not going to use two. Sorry if I had a big correction moment. But here we got the other figures in Loyal Subjects. We got Udaraka, which we have. The Short Tongue Asui. Ida from My Hero Academia. I finally got his name right. <laughs> All Might from Loyal Subjects. All for One Powered Up Midoriya. Another Asui with a longer tongue. Wow, that's pretty cool. And a Golden Edition Mask Midoriya. Another Ida. And of course... Midoriya, regular. Bakugo, nice. And Todoroki. And here, this, this line comes from Loyal Subjects. Which it says right there, if you can make it out. If you can't, sorry, it's hard to get it on camera. It's so small. But this is their My Hero Academia line. And that's all there is to say. For the package in, now we're going to look at the collector's card. Here we got Udaraka, and her quirk is zero gravity. Ain't that one cool power? And we got a bio, if you wish to read it. And yeah, she secretly has a crush on Deku, and <laughs> that's why I like her. You know what I mean? Sorry if I couldn't help but laugh. But now, for comparison, here she is with the Short Tongue Asui, which we did review on this channel. And they look good together, if I do say so myself. Really well sculpted. Really well detailed. I love it. And now we're going to compare Udaraka with her McFarlane version. Here we have the McFarlane Udaraka with her helmet compared to the Loyal Subjects one. And they look pretty neat together. I dig them. I'm going to display these two together for certain. And you're probably wondering, where did I get this figure? Well, I got this from eBay for, th for uh, sorry about the, I have to correct the price error. <laughs> I had another, t another confused moment. My autism really getting the better of me in this review. I got this from eBay for $9. Is she worth it to add to your My Hero Academia collection? Oh yeah, these are worth it. I am definitely liking these from Loyal Subjects. Best Loyal Subjects ever. And given I like figures that are really well sculpted and painted, they're worth the money to add to your collection. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out.